If you would like to see how I revamped this curly wavy hair, keep watching. So this wig unit is from Wild African. It's the Brazilian Water Wave and the description code is GFL12. So I've been having this curly wig for about 10 months now. And um, what I did when I first purchased the wig, because I like it to be a slightly bit fuller, I added some hair right there in the bottom section of the wig. And this is something that I always normally do just because I like my units to be very full. But that hair has gotten old and tangly and I just really didn't like the overall quality of it. So I'm actually getting ready to take that hair out right now. So now I'm just sectioning off the part that I'm getting ready to cut out and that will be all the hair that's at the lower um, perimeter of the wig. So now that that's all out, let's get started. So I'm using a water wave texture that's from BrazilianHairOnSale.com. That is the name of the site and I will make sure that I link it below. And I brought a bundle of 24 inches which I'm sewing in right now. And I also brought a bundle of 22 inches that I will be sewing in as well. In different segments of this video, the lighting is very, very poor. My sincere apologies, but it does get better really, really soon. I don't understand because there was so much good natural lighting that day, but when I would go back and look at the footage, it was still really dark. So unfortunately, I had to depend on the artificial lighting, which is never really a good thing but you gotta do what you gotta do so i tried to make it work but it does get better really soon so most wig units come with that extra lace at the lower neckline of the wig and that's where i normally start sewing in the extra hair and that's what i'm doing right here as mentioned before i'm sewing in the 24 inches and um, later you will see that I will go through the wig and sew in a little bit more of the 24 and then I'll start sewing in the 22. So now I'm moving on up with this wig and this technique is really easy because what I'm going to do is sew directly on top of those wefts where I cut the hair or where the hair had um, shed it and it makes it really simple doing this way. I'm literally just sewing like directly on those wefts.
Um, please don't ask me what happened with the color here because I won't really be able to explain it. So let's just lean with it, rock with it. But yeah, you get the picture. I mean, kind of. But yeah, we're making progress. It's a very saturated, bright picture. So I'm still following the same technique here. I'm just sewing directly on top of those webs and it really didn't take me long at all. One thing I like about this hair company is their webs were very, very easy to stick the needle right through and that just made it painless. So it went by pretty quick. And I'm pretty much done. It was very easy, quick, breezy. So now I'm getting ready to tame this baby using my spray bottle, which has water and conditioner in it. I'm using my Vidal Sassoon Pro Series Sculpted Waves Conditioner. Then I'm gonna follow up with my ORS Curls Unleash Leave-In Conditioner that has shea butter and mango. And I'm really loving the quality of the hair from BrazilianHairOnSale.com. Like I said, I will link them below. It is the Brazilian Water Wave Texture. Um, I barely got any shedding. As you can see, I started off just kind of finger combing it but yeah the hair was so soft so pretty and um the hair itself the wig from wow african is the bomb i love this wig like i said i've been having it for approximately about 10 months now and um where the lace is located the hair is still really really full i never went through and did like a pluck or anything like that because i just feel like after plucking you run the risk of the wig shedding really badly so i really don't plug any of my wig units but yes very happy with wowafrican.com as always and brazilian hair on sale has really really fabulous hair so check them out So this hair is looking beautiful. I just want you to know. All right, I'm gonna stop. But yes, the hair is so beautiful, soft, it's voluptuous, and I am very happy. And as you can see, it's very easy to just revamp, remix your old wig unit. You don't have to just toss it out when you feel like it's over because you know the hair has shed it a lot. All you gotta do is order yourself. A couple of bundles maybe even one depending on how full you like it and just add that here on in there and you're good to go and keep in mind that originally this wig was only 22 inches so I added in the 24 and 22 inch pack which made the wig even longer so that's really super cool that you can even make your units longer by just ordering the wefts and longer lengths and voila there you have it And that's all folks. Thank you so very much for watching. I truly hope this video was helpful. Please don't forget to subscribe so you can keep up with all of my future videos. And please do come back again. Bye.